down. I'm Derek Ray, and sharing commentary with me, as usual, is Stuart Robson. And today, it's the opening game in this particular group at the Euros. It's Spain against Italy. Well, these teams know they cannot afford to drop points today. It's so and he's broken free. Trying to lock the keeper. Well, they don't think high marks are going to be dished out for that effort. Well, I can see what he was trying to do, but he just got it all wrong there. Well, it's a 12th European Championship appearance for Spain. Winners in 1964, 2008 and 2012. You've got to say, Stuart, it's a tricky-looking group for them. Croatia, Italy and Albania. But their talent level is high. It certainly is. Spain have got some great young players. But the problem they've had in previous tournaments is, do they play with enough penetration? Yes, they keep possession. Yes, they like to have the ball. But you have to penetrate when you get into the right sort of areas. And that's been the problem for Spain recently. I think they're going to get through this group. Can they go all the way? Probably not. Chiesa counter attacking chance can they make it count well it looks so promising but it all comes to nothing Morata Morata well he shoots the bounce helps him and he's kept it out fully stretched somehow reaching it Short corner, let's see. That's excellent defending following the cross. Oyar Sabal. Marino. Stopped a certain goal. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Surprise, is it? They've been in complete control here. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. And back underway. 1-0 it is. It's there for him! And he passed the power test. Shame about the accuracy. Well, the stats tell you everything. The chances have been few and far between, and they haven't tested the goalkeeper anywhere near enough. If they want to get something from this game, they're going to have to improve in the final third. And in the right position to read it. Chiesa. Decides to shoot.
Federico Chiesa. There will be one minute added on at the end. Gianluca Scamacca. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, Morata was busy and influential in the first half, certainly. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. Chiesa. Excellent defending. Mikel Marino. Oya Sabal. Sound piece of goalkeeping. can he do with it and saved by the keeper and decided that now is the time to go to the bench and over comes the corner what a vital intervention It is a free kick. And the substitution will occur now. lost his focus for a second and a throw in conceded Danny Olmo well that's how to beat your opponent and a good looking ball and still dangerous well, it came to nothing in the end. Chiesa. Well, it could be on for him here. A goal! Real excitement! A back and forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions. And that's a great finish from Chiesa. 1v1 against the keeper. He never looked like this in Guinea. That's a top-class finish. Back underway. Level pegging. One goal apiece in this game. minutes remaining well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done well good run and good ball control it needs an accurate cross firing it in and the keeper taking care of the situation work from Spain to win back possession and he's made headway and a goal in the lead again fully deserved well here it is again he goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder and when he gets onto it he holds off the challenge, keeps his balance, and makes good contact with the ball. That's a top-class finish. Well, that reaction says it all. That's such an important goal in this game. Well, 
have a dramatic moment near the end, and that might well be the decider. In with a chance. Oh, goodness me. He made it far too easy for the keeper, didn't he? Well, that save has just about kept them in it, but they have to pose more of a threat at the other end. Teammates available on the ball in an attacking position, but they've got to do something positive quickly. Well, he has the measure of his opponent. Good defending in the end, and danger averted for now. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. And it's over now. A win for Spain. It has gone according to their master plan. Stuart, what have you made of their performance? Well, Derek, it was very competitive. Chances at both ends, but I feel they were the better team, and they deserve their victory. Movement was just too good for those defenders. It's a really good display.